Hi and welcome to Divi Coaching, a short tutorial today where we're going to be looking at how to put more than one button on a single row in Divi. So of course if you want three or four buttons next to each other you can always put in a row with three or four columns but there's an easier way to automatically space the buttons out across a single row. So let's have a look at how to do that. So I have a new page here with a single row containing a block of text and say we want a row of five buttons underneath that. So I'm going to add a new row. I'm going to choose a single column and I'm going to add a single button module. As we want five buttons, I'm now going to go in and copy that button five times. And obviously each time I copy, it's going to stack these buttons up. So what we now need to do is distribute these buttons evenly across the row. So in order to do that, we go into the row settings, then into the column settings, click on the advanced tab and we need a small bit of CSS so we click on custom CSS and in the main element we say display flex and immediately those buttons arrange themselves horizontally in the row but they pack themselves tight up against the left hand side. In order to space them out we have various options but the easiest one is to go justify content and we can say space around and what that will do is it will put an, an even margin on either side of the button. So you can see there's a space here, there'll be double the space between each button and then there'll be a space at the end. Another option you have rather than um, space around is space between. So if we go back into the column settings again, back to the advanced, back to custom CSS and we edit this to be space between instead of space around. It's a very similar look but what you now end up with is the edges of the buttons are tight up against the ends of the row. We can still adjust the spacing of the buttons on an individual basis. And the nice thing is all the others will automatically adjust to compensate. So say we want this button in the middle to be something special, we can go into the button settings, into the design tab, choose button, and say for example we want to change the background color, so we'll change it to red, and then we can go down to the spacing settings and we can increase the padding so give it an extra 50 pixels on either side and you'll see that the button grows but the other buttons automatically shuffle along to take up the extra space. I hope that's been a valuable lesson. To learn more just google Flexbox and have a look particularly at the Justify content uh, settings and that will allow you to see the various options available to you. Thank you very much and I'll see you next time.